The second annual Meritage of Miracles event was held tonight at the Hollywood Gaming Racecourse. It's an event to help raise money for the palliative care to provide help for families with children living with special needs. 27 First News reporter Derek Lewis is live in the studio with more on those details. Good evening, Derek. Hey, Matt, the money that was raised from the event tonight will go back to the families in need. Now, I want to introduce to you Rhonda Walker, who has received palliative care and shares how it has changed her life. Two-year-old Carter James was born with a rare brain disorder. If it wasn't for palliative care, um, I would have felt so alone. When Carter was born, Rhonda Walker was a single mother and a new parent of a child living with special needs. She was offered palliative care and support throughout her journey. And I said, I will take any support I can take. Many children with serious illnesses like Carter receive the medical treatment they need. But for just 14 years, have families received the emotional and financial support from Akron Children's Hospital. Whenever a family is, is facing a life-threatening condition in their child, we like to kind of embrace that family and try to anticipate their needs, help guide them through medical decision-making. Hundreds of people were at the second annual Meritage of Miracles event for food, entertainment, and a silent auction. All the money will go to Akron Children's Hospital and help with efforts to bring the program closer to home. We're trying to bring palliative care medicine to the Mahoning Valley. It's currently at the Akron campus, the main campus, but we're trying to bring it here. Although there are services available for families in the valley, Dr. Freebert feels there's more that can be done. What's been missing is to be so close and to be right here and have dedicated personnel who are able to respond quickly and network with the agencies in the community like hospice or like some of the other community support agencies. Rhonda says accepting the care was a great decision. She thinks all parents who can take advantage of it should do so. It would be in your best interest to say yes because they're, they are there for you for a lifetime and for the whole journey. And last year was the first year of the event. They raised $14,000 to help the program grow. All right, some good information, Derek. Thanks. Yeah.